Bum 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 bum. Tomatoes. Let's say you're using the new 4.14 auto mesh reduction tool to reduce the LODs, but you actually want to maybe take those LODs out to another program, or you just want a lower LOD version without keeping the original. Well, how would you do that? Well, here's just the tip. We have our LOD system in 4.14 and allows us to get some LOD levels using the auto LOD system. So in this case, I have my base one, my LOD level one, which isn't much of a difference, and then LOD level two, which is crunched down pretty good to about 10%. But I want this. Let's say it's an actual car or a prop or something where I want to then take this altered LOD version pull it out, maybe do a little bit of tweaking or relaxing to get a little bit better result and bring it back in. Well, if I was to go into my system, let's pull up my sphere, and I was to export out, uh, stupid, there we go, migrate, and I export out the asset, it's gonna give me the original mesh, but that's not what we want. What we can do is if you have your item selected, and it has the other LOD groups in it. This is actually built into it and the system knows it has LO other LODs. You can go into the window, developer tools, merge actors. And while this is intended to merge different actors into one, it has an option for using specific LOD detail. By default, it's said to use all. If you change it to use specific, you can then put in the LOD detail you want it to write out at. In this case, I want it to write out LOD level two merge actors let's go ahead and save it somewhere new i'll go ahead and save it in my root folder and then that's it it will save it out as a new actor we can actually put it into our scene not actor new mesh and you can see right here we have our new mesh which has our lower lod from group 2 94 sphere lod group 94 and we're good now we could go ahead if we want to and export this out by migrating and clean it up a little bit or you can just use it as a temporary prop or whatever you feel like. But that is how you would get out the different LOD groups. Unfortunately, you would have to do that for each group by simply selecting your original, going back to the developer tools, merge actors, and selecting the next one, if we wanted one, for example, and merge it into a different one. But this is a nice way of getting them out without having to do it all in an external program and maybe just keeping your different levels. And with that said, that is just the tip.